Despite weekly garbage collection, Windsor struggles to curb its trash problem. It's easy to find illegal dumping across the city. It's just a mess, you know, like anywhere where it's dark and concealed, where people are under the cover of dark and they'll just dump everything and anything. It's a real problem, eh, because it makes the city look unkept. The city's only waste transfer station is located off Central Avenue, making it difficult for residents to dispose of large waste, like mattresses, properly. The inaccessibility prompts illegal disposal on private property. I've noticed some illegal dumping behind my apartment building. Um, our garbages get emptied one day and they're full the next, so it's actually a problem. It's getting to look like Detroit in certain areas, especially along University Avenue West, Wyandotte West, near the university. People leave their garbage everywhere on the abandoned lots, and that's exactly what's happening in Windsor. We can't help but notice that it's still got a kind of third world aspect to it. This issue has not gone unnoticed by locals and they want action to be taken soon. Offer um, more places for them to dump their garbage or cheaper fees at the dump or services from the city. I think that um, making it so that people are more educated on what can and can't be thrown out. Past proposals from city council like Kuzmeritech's free large goods drop off have been rejected but they are working on developing a new program that's efficient for taxpayers. There will be like some kind of voucher program. You'll be able to buy a voucher for like 10 bucks or something. They'll give you some type, type of permanent sticker, put it on a couch or mattress, and then the city will come by and they'll know and they'll take it. I think being Canadians, you ought to clean up your act and make yourselves proud again. Madison Seeger, The30.ca.